What's up guys? Welcome back to Amazing RC. Well, I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas and hope you're going to have an extremely exciting New Year's. As for us down here at Amazing RC, well, I went and played Christmas for myself this year because I have been dreaming about a Traxxas Emax, a brushed version with the legendary two motor setup for a very long time. Now, this truck when it first debuted was well over $400. I think it was actually approaching $500 and that was for the brushed model. They did make a brushless model of this truck. I got the RTR version. I would have took just about anything and I uh, got one brand spanking new. This definitely coming up guys. We did finally get to get one. The only way to do this was to make some money. Now, I had mixed results online when I said that I was going to get rid of the TRX4. Now, you guys know this, this is my baby. Now, this truck has been through many, many, many uh, different, different bodies and different uh, setups. I've gone brushless, I've gone mud, I've gone, you know, uh, um, in and out of waterfalls. I've done everything you can do to this truck. But I knew that out of all of my vehicles with the X-Max, you know, not in the list, this was going to be the one that would bring me as close to the $350 that I needed for the, the E-Max. And I had absolutely no money to put for RC. So I decided to let go of the TRX4. Now, again, in the beginning of this adventure, I had stated because I didn't want to do a different body. Everybody loved the Volkswagen bug body when I put it on the TRX4 because it fits so good. So I wanted to keep that. Well, I had already painted the inside of the body and I wanted to do something different. So I painted the outside of the body, this really cool color changing white. You get it out in the sun, it'll have these really cool purple tones to it. And I also added this really cool aluminum uh, uh, sheeting to the sides of it. And uh, it just has a really cool look to it. It's super industrial. I did my cool little rope thingy. It's got the fifth wheel on the back. Other than that, uh, there are a couple things that we did to it. Um, remember I still had the nine tooth pinion gear. I threw a brand new motor in it. It has the replaced ESC that I put in it. It's got a wet box out of, oh, I don't know, something, something else TRX4 for the electronics. Everything in here is completely waterproof. It's ready to rock and roll. We did the uh, magnet setup that we did before. It still has the stock steering servo on it and it's completely fine. Fifth wheels on the back. That's pretty much it. If you remember, I actually locked the differentials and I also switched where the two-speed transmission was up to the toggle switch above here because I kept running into the two-speed transmission when I didn't want to. Now, Christmas Eve, I had a very good friend of mine stop by the house to wish my family and myself a Merry Christmas. And in doing so, completely unrelated, I wanted to show him where I was at on this cool new build that I was doing and let him know that I was in fact selling this car. Hey, isn't this cool? I did not know that they love Volkswagen bugs. I had no idea. And uh, the gentleman that is purchasing this truck has never before done anything with hobby grade RC. So this brand new, you know, setup from a TRX4 standpoint, He's going to be able to point this thing at anything and drive. So I'm very excited about that. I actually, I got a charger set up. I actually took the two brand new nickel metal high drive batteries that I got out of the Emax. So these are brand spanking new and he's going to have two batteries with it. Um, I'm very excited. He told me two things. He said, I like purple and I love the number 69. And I said, okie dokie, I can do that. So if you remember, we were going to do the Johnny Rain style and paint the outside of this vehicle, which was perfectly applied to this particular circumstance. Now, the only thing I'm going to do besides what's on here now, because this is going tomorrow, is I'm going to pull the, the, little, the little lights out of here and I'm going to paint those purple. I'm also going to pull the wing in the back and I'm going to paint the lime purple here to match the top. Now... I, I totally dig it. He has not seen this yet. Tomorrow we're going to get a run video out of this as well as the uh, Red Cat. And uh, I'm actually going to show him uh, the you know around the TRX4. And uh, I just know for a fact he's going to love this thing. Um, his eyes were giant saucers when he first saw it and he hasn't even seen it with the new paint. So guys, we got lots coming on this channel. Again, I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. Um, here's some video of uh, some of the cool stuff that I ended up doing to this to get it to where it's at now. Tomorrow, guys, we'll have a video of the actual run footage. 
and a lot more coming up as well. It's Brian, it's Amazing RC guys, and we'll see you very soon with another really cool video.